guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to Cambers designs if today is your first time visiting my channel oh my gosh <laughs> welcome back to my channel guys to my existing subscribers you guys know I love it so so much <laughs> welcome back to my channel so guys today's video is all about um industrial machine so i'm just gonna be showing you guys how to make use of your machine your industrial machine your flatbed machine and just sitting there out a lot of my subscribers come to my dm and they tell me campers please um can you tell me how i can use my sewing arms can you show me how i can use my flatbed machine so i'm just gonna be showing you guys everything here so guys you need to watch this video and please watch the video to the end <laughs> so guys um please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also don't forget to like my videos oh my gosh guys don't forget to like my videos <laughs> and also don't forget to comment don't forget to share my videos thank you very much and god bless you i love you all So guys, um, when you press here, it means on, and here is the hook. So I'm just gonna press the spring button to on the um, machine. You guys can actually hear the sound. So guys, next thing I'm just gonna be doing right now is I actually want to reel my thread. So I'm making use of this thread, this black thread here. So. I'm just going to take my scissors I'm just going to take my scissors and then trim you know the tip a little bit just and then I'm just going to bring it past the tray to this place and bring it up so guys um, this is the tray here so I've just passed it through this floor here so I'm just going to take it down, just take it down to this place. So this is the tray here. Next thing I'm just going to be doing right now is to pass the tray through here. And then I'm just going to bring it up here. I'm just gonna bring it out here and I have to bring it out here I hope you guys can see what I just did just pass it through this hole and then bring it out here and the next thing I'm just gonna be doing right now is to pass it through here through this place so I'm just gonna pass it through this place here so sorry for the noise so i'm just gonna pass it through like this then bring it out like this so so the next thing to do is just to put the tray like this and then after doing it like that if you notice this is a tray here so you're just gonna take it like this So just take this place. So the next thing is just gonna pin it like this. The next thing guys is to take this is a, um I don't know what it's called, but you just have to take it up. Guys, this is what I mean. So I mean this is to take the teeth here. Is to take it down so when you put this when you pull it up then the tip will go up when you pull it down here then it's go that it's go down so right now I want to reel so I'm just gonna take it off because I want the stick to the carp as well so guys the next thing I'm just going to do right now is to hunt this after switching it on, I've already pinned this. I've already taken this part, the tweet is off. Then the next thing is to do. I'm just 
to now release the zip clips. So guys, after that, I'm just going to cut this here and then pull hearts. This is it. So guys, um, this is the ruler here and this is called um, shortsu. So basically guys, I'm just going to take this inside here and then I'm just going to bring out the tray here. Just dry it a little bit, not too hard. And when you, you know, just it will just come out in a very easy way. So guys, um, you know, the next thing is when you open here, you see where you where you're gonna be putting your shorts. So I'm just gonna take this and then just put it here. So guys, this is where you have your shotu. This is where you have your shotu. And now, I would like to pass my tray. You know, just pass them. So um, the first thing is to take your tray. Just take your tray. Um, just pass it through. You know, just pass it through here. So I'm just gonna pass it through here and. After passing it through here, and then I'm just gonna press it through the side. So, guys, I'm working on um, flat bed machine. So, just pass it through here also, and then I'm just gonna go like this. I'm just gonna go like this to this place, and then I'm just gonna pass through here. And after passing it through here, the next thing I'm just going to be doing right now is to take it like this. Okay, let me just take it just a little bit so you guys can understand. Let me take it again. You know, you just have to take it here like this. Just through here. You notice this? Well, I don't know the name. So, after taking it here, you know just here 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 let me show you guys again here then to this place then to this place then you just take it here you bring it to the side then you just take this like this inside bring it out I mean just take it like that you know I hope you guys are seeing this right now I don't know if you guys so you just have to take it like this make sure you know it's like this then you just take it inside here mm. okay so we're getting there so just pass it through here After that, you just have to bring it here and then take it inside this hole and then bring it to the needle. So guys, this is it. Guys, so this is it, and 
the next thing is to hold my machine then i'm just gonna take this right inside to pick the thread inside out guys this is it so guys um next thing i'm gonna be doing right now is to take i'm just gonna take a little bit of this leather here and um you know just stitch a little bit i just want you guys to see how it looks now i'm gonna be folding this this is a synthetic material and it's thick so i'm just gonna fold it into two and then i'm just gonna stitch it so guys basically i'm raising it here when you raise this like this then automatically the mouse of the tip of the switches go up back down so guys so guys um the next thing is to you know now we're ready to stitch so i'm just gonna fold this you know just like this so you just stitch like this then you just back stitch so I'm just gonna take this again like this like I said, um, no, actually I have not said this, sir. I have not talked about it. I did not reduce the speed of this machine, so I'm still using the speed like that. So you just have to do it, take it back and, you know, just have to control it from the pedal. Just make sure that you're not driving it too fast and also you're not driving it too slow. So, you know, you just, um, just have to balance it. Um, so this right now I'm just gonna show you guys again you can see how I'm you know driving it little 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 like I'm not driving it too fast so I'm just gonna press this now to take it I mean to back stitch and then bring it back so basically guys um, this is how to use your machine guys watch out for my um new video coming out soon so i'll be showing you guys how to trade your um industrial cylinder harms machine so this is the only one i'll be showing you guys today so basically guys this is where um you know you put your oil you feel you feel your oil there and you close it back thank you so much for watching thank you so much for your support please don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like thank you and god bless you